What's up YouTube fam? It's your favorite girl Jay Shara coming back to you with yet another reaction video. This video I'm going to be reacting to today is Burt Kreischer. He's gonna be reacting to Tom Segura. I guess he has this video to Missy Elliott's music and he's dancing to it. Um, the fact that you all recommended it to me and said, you know, I absolutely have to watch it. I'm pretty sure it's going to be absolutely horrendous and hilarious at the same time. Um, in my opinion, I feel like I wouldn't expect Tom to be, you know, in America's Best Dance Crew or, you know, the best dancer alive. So I'm pretty sure I'm about to be cracking the hell up on my own. So yeah, before we get into this video, make sure you subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already. We are on the road to 50K. Tap that notification bell and also follow me on Instagram at jshar with an H at the end. Other than that, let's get into the video. I would rather drive, I would rather drive. And he's like, it's 300 bucks. Well, so, you, you do do great promos, but um, I made a promo video. Do you want to see it? Put your headphones on. You're going to dig this one. This is pretty cool. He's just like, what? You're going to like it. What do I even expect? All right, here's my uh, promo is video. Is it doing blackface? No, no, no. I just, oh, you know, gonna show it? just wanted to show you. Wait, blackface? Why would he be... I mean, my God. Oh, my God. I can't dance. Look at those tits. Oh, oh, oh my God. God. I'm going to have to have a hip thrust. I'm going to vomit. His poor wife. He's a wife? Oh, my God. Maybe he's a little peepee. This guy's definitely racist, right? <laughs> he probably stinks, too. Hey, Tom Segura. You've been dancing your whole life. I know. Show this fool up. Ponytail for me. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Uh, first of all, 
First of all, for why, people that don't know, why was the wig involved? There is a famous meme of Seagal eating a carrot when he was in Belarus. Fuck that! And that was the inspiration um, for for my attire because I'm a big Seagal fan. Um, but then, so the whole joke, obviously, we wanted uh, a, a guy to be Bert, so we wanted like a 400 pound guy. But then they were like, let's try to do face replacement. Everyone's been doing face replacement. Is like uh, Brian Monarch's been doing that I on these hate videos. That you have my face forever now. And then <laughs> you have my face for in perpetuity. You So we get done last two bears oh my God. And Tom says, Hey man, my buddy Rami's out there, he's directing my sp- did he even direct your special? He did. He did. Okay. <laughs> Fucking piece of shit. <laughs> I'm blackballing him in Hollywood. He loves you. Oh fuck. He him. by the way, he left way when you left when you left, he called me, he goes, I feel terrible, he's the nicest guy. <laughs> so So we Tom goes, We're gonna do these new promos for fucking two bears, one cave. Do you mind hanging out for like an hour while they shoot your face? Because they're gonna do our faces and all these different things, and I was like, and we yeah. showed you the commercial that he did with like Pharrell. And yeah, it was that. really cool looking. And I was like, yeah, I'll do it. And in my head, I'm like, it seems like a lot of money to put into a fucking podcast, but <laughs> okay. So I sat in the lobby doing different facial expressions for like an hour with this kid, and he just and he was like, all right, can you look surprised, look sad, look like all the fucking <laughs> favorite for this guy. They didn't even mic you. They didn't even mic <laughs> I didn't even notice. I just I go, like, <laughs> the part he goes, he goes, well, yeah, he goes. I just like taped a mic to a thing that wasn't even on. I was like, this will get it. Wow, oh. wow, oh my god, wow. It, 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 and, and I sat there for an hour. And Tom goes, I'm gonna go run home, put and Alice put down. Alice to bed. And then they're like, I, these fucking liars are like, hey, Tom's on his way back. Tom said he'll be back in 15. I'm like, okay, we can do it. I sat out there for an hour doing all the facial recognition for you. For me. For your yeah. fucking video. Yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. How many wow. are you going to get on that? <laughs> I have no idea. I actually don't know if it'll get uh, even however many of you. You know what I mean? Like, I just uploaded it right now, right as you walked in. I, I Is just, it a minute? Huh? Is no, it it's over a minute. God yeah. damn it, Tom. That's where you fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> it's at 130K so far. <laughs> on what? On my... Just on Twitter. Oh, okay. Oh, my Twitter's going to be blowing the fuck up. I got to delete that picture of you. Here I am trying to shame you this morning, and I'll get stabbed as a fat fuck. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, my gosh. Tom Segura dressed as Steven Seagal official. Ethan Page. Oh, fuck. That two, okay, was two words. words. Two words. Two. Ugh. Two words. No mercy. <laughs> Literally. Two words. No mercy. Literally. Uh, so here's the thing. A lot of people were like, they're like, what the fuck? Why do you stab him? Yeah. Stab him? So I wanted to tell you where that came from. I did. Please. The original idea was that I would stab you and then get a handgun. So we had it there. Shoot you. Then I drop that. I have a shotgun. I put six shells in it. I shoot you. And then I get a machine gun and I shoot you with that. Yeah. But we ran out of time. Oh. So I only stabbed you. Oh, this is so good. <laughs> good right? This is so good. Like, it, that was literally so much, but my question was, okay, why did you stab Bert? You say, oh no, you know, that wasn't the original plan. But my question is, where did the inspiration come to harm me at all? Like, are you insane? They are just too much, and I love Bert's attitude. The whole time he's watching, he's like, okay, this is funny. Then he's like, what the fuck? Why am I in this? I'm appalled. Then you kill me. Now I'm dead. But at the end, he's just like, you know what? This is great. I love his attitude. He's just so light and humorous about everything. Love people like him. I really, really, really do enjoy their podcast because a lot of people like to talk about problems and issues and you know, social injustice and everything. Which they probably do because this is only my third reaction for their podcast. They probably get a little bit serious, but they're not too serious. Like they can just joke around and be themselves. And sometimes I know even myself before, I'll just speak on my behalf when I say I wasn't as educated on podcasts 
as I'm beginning to you know, know now, I used to think that you have to be serious and you have to come on there with a purpose, but with them, they're showing you there's absolutely no rules. We're just coming on here to chat as if we were the only two people who would have insight on this conversation. I really enjoy that. I really enjoy that this is fun, it's light, and we get to see you know, who they really are. I really do enjoy that. So yeah, if you enjoyed this reaction, be sure to give me a beautiful thumbs up. If you have any other recommendations that you believe is truly, absolutely reaction worthy, don't hesitate to drop that down in the comment section. And I will try to get back to everyone ASAP. Other than that, if you have not done so already, be sure to subscribe to my channel as we are on the road to 50K. Also be sure to tap that notification bell and also follow me on Instagram at jshar with an H at the end. You all know that I love you. You love yourself 10 times more. Have a beautiful day or night in this amazing world. Ciao.